Hello and welcome. A new case in normal distribution, and that is in a factory there are ten thousand workers and the mean daily wages rupees seven hundred fifty and then its standard deviation is fifty. Find the minimum daily income of the one hundred workers with the highest daily income. The one hundred workers who earns highest per day, we need to find out the lowest income in that group. So, hundred out of ten thousand means one percent. So we can say that we need to find out the lowest daily income of the top one percent workers. Okay, one percent is important thing. Top one percent. That means extreme right hand side area. We are interested in this region. These are the hundred workers out of ten thousand who earns most of. Rather more than all other nine thousand nine hundred workers. So we can divide the entire normal curve in three parts. Less than mean point five or fifty percent. One percent the workers earning at the highest rate, and forty nine percent earning between mean and the lowest of the higher group, higher income group. Now we want to find out the value of x. The interpretation of this question is nothing but the value of x at this point is what. Now the area between z zero and z at this point is point four nine. Find out the area in the normal curve with you, which is point four nine, and then find out the relevant value of z. And it comes to two point three three. We have we have taken this value from the table. This is nothing. One type of uh, reverse calculation. Z is x minus mean upon standard deviation, right hand side. So Z will be positive two point three three equals to x minus seven hundred fifty upon. 50. So 50 into 2.33 equals to x minus 750. Multiplication of these two comes to 116.5 equals to x minus 750. So 750 plus 116.5 is equal to x, and therefore x comes to 866.5. And that means x at this point is 866.5. So, this one percent workers have income more than eight hundred sixty-six point five, and remaining ninety-nine percent workers have daily income eight hundred sixty-six point five or other or less. So we can say that the minimum daily income of the hundred workers with the highest daily income comes to rupees eight hundred sixty-six. The precise interpretation is. If we check the list of the hundred workers with the highest daily income, the income of the last hundred worker is eight hundred sixty six point five, or say approximately eight hundred sixty six or eight hundred sixty seven, if we take it in integer value or in uh, say exact rupees. The income of the last person in the list of the top hundred. Workers. That's it. Thank you.